Hi, and welcome to another Canva for Authors video. I'm going to show you how to make an animation a bit like this one, which I made using elements of my book cover. I made this originally in uh, Instagram squares, but I'm going to try and make it again as a TikTok video. Alrighty, let's go. Before we do that, don't forget to like and subscribe. It makes a massive difference. And if you subscribe, you'll get a notification every time I upload a new video, which is usually about once every two weeks. And if you are an author who would like to talk to other authors who like Canva, uh, come and join the free and fun Facebook group, Canva for Authors. I will put the link in the description below. All right, let's go. All right, do we go to create a design and mm, mobile video? Let's call it that. So this is the book cover of Playing for Love. And I want to make an animation using elements that are in the cover. Partly because I just want to play with animation. Okay. So what I would like to do is, so this is a, a book about a computer game. So it's got your five lives that you get and one of them has been used up. And the strap line is, it's all fun and games until your heart is on the line. So what I would like to do is animate those two things. So first thing I'm gonna do is make this huge so that we've got the hearts in very clear focus. Okay. Maybe a bit smaller so you can actually read it. Nope, let's not do that. Uh, let's have a look. Let's make the background the same blue so that it's less obvious that it's been chopped off. Okay. Right, so what I want to do is I want to hide this bit here. So for that, let's find make a rectangle. R on your keyboard will give you a rectangle. Change color and no, not like that. I need to go this way. There's a couple of ways you could get rid of it. I'm just going to get rid of it by hiding it. But you could, if you wanted, use the erase feature and um, use magic erase and just erase it. Okay. A bit bigger. Not much though. That'll do. Okay. Now I'm going to duplicate this page and I'm just going to pick out one of these hearts. So let's edit photo and crop. So I'm going to crop it until I've got just the one heart in the frame. Okay. Now I'm going to move this one heart over here. I'll try and get it to sit. Sometimes it is quite difficult. Do you hold shift and move it by one pixel by using the keyboards, keyboard keys. Okay, right. So we've got that, it's in position. And then we're gonna go to animate. I'm gonna go to these new animation things here and do pulse. There we go. Okay. Now I need to, I'm going to replace the text with text of my own. It's going to say the same thing. It's just easier if, I'm 
Right, it says it's all fun and games, which should go over here like this. And okay. Right, let's select it and turn the text to white. So all fun and games. Oh, I think I've still got one of the dots left in black. There we go. And then copy that down. Until your heart is on the line. Full stop. Okay, that looks right. Once we've got this, we're going to select all or we'll just duplicate it. Duplicate page. Okay. All right, so we're going to go to the first page where the heart is beating and we're going to take that off and we're going to make this roll in not effects we need animate uh, okay that would do wouldn't it or maybe that no there too fussy no no okay i like that one shift let's do that one word and direction that way that'll do it's all fun and games and then hopefully this heart is still animated that's still pulsing good and then page two until it's until your heart is on the line and let's get rid of that and then page three is Oh, let's just duplicate this page again. Page three is, let's get rid of all of these extra bits. It's just the book cover. Let's just check there aren't any extra things on there. Where's my layers panel gone? Okay, that just means it's not there, right? So that's cool. To make the background yellow. Play for love. And maybe a buy button. Or read now. Now I could find a button element and um, put that in the background. But I'm not going to do that. I'm going to try something else. So we're going to go to effects and background. Turn that to red. That works too. Okay. And if I was putting this on TikTok, I would maybe put some text behind it, uh, in front of it, but with the tropes on it. Edit photo, Let's give it a shadow. Shadows, drop shadow. There, okay. And let's do three seconds. Apply to all three pages. And this one, maybe we could do match and move. Let's see if that works. If it doesn't, we'll remove it. Let's change that so that it's actually 3.5 seconds. And they all last a little bit longer. Let's try that.
Easy. Nice little animation using the cool new animation features. Now all you have to do is hit share, download as an MP4, and uh, share it somewhere else when you're ready. That's all there is to it. I hope you found that useful. Uh, if you did, please tell all your friends. And there's loads more videos, just check them out. And as I said before, if you are an author who wants to talk about Canva, come and join the Canva for Authors community on Facebook. If there's anything you'd like me to show you how to make, just drop me a note in the comments and I will see what I can do. Thank you for your time.